that children are able to be tricked by deceitful plotting. Huh? My God, you ought to be able to, if you don't, listen, I, my, that's my prayer. If you come here long enough, I pray that you can't be tossed to and fro. You can't be driven by any wind or any strange doctrine. And that you can't be tricked by deceitful plotting. My God, that's what matters. It doesn't matter how many's in the congregation, but as the people in the congregation, it's solid and steadfast and unmovable. Is there anybody in this place with me? I'd rather have a church of 200 and all of them went to heaven than 20,000 and only half of them made it. Amen. Somebody say amen. amen. Look here. I'm going to keep going. It says, but speaking the truth in love, may grow up in all things unto him who is head, Christ. Look over at somebody beside you. This is your chance again. Now tell them to grow up. Huh. You told them to quit being a child. Now you're telling them to grow up. See, you're already working. You're already doing it. I've equipped you. You're doing it. Huh. Look here. He says, speaking the truth in love, there we see it again, may grow up in all things. There we see it again. A few verses early, he said he wants you to be the perfect or complete man. Now he's saying he wants you to grow up in all things. What? The gospel should be able to work in every area of your life. You should grow. Paul said when I was a child, I did childish things. Now that I'm a man, I put away childish things. That better be God. Huh. I, I got to use it, Rocky. I got to use it. You keep doing it, you'll get your chance sometime. Huh? Listen. It says, but they're speaking in truth and in love. Huh? He says to grow up in all things in him who is head. Whenever the gospel is being preached, it ought to impact every area of your life. You ought to grow up in your marriage. You ought to grow up in your finances. You ought to grow up in your spirit. You ought to grow up in how you talk. You ought to grow up in how you walk. Every area of your life ought to be maturing. Amen. Come on, somebody. If you're missing an area in your life, it's because you're lacking in that area. Any area of your life that you feed, that's why we got to preach the balanced gospel. If I just come up and preach to you a God of judgment and a God that's going to get you if you sin, even though God is going to be our supreme almighty judge, if that's the only thing I preach, you're not going to grow in every area. The only area you're going to grow in is the God of judgment and a God of wrath and a God that's wanting to kill and a God that's wanting to take you and destroy because of sin. Yes, he wants to destroy sin, but that's only part of him. The other part of him is that he died to save you from sin. And he made a way out. And he's got grace and mercy. And that when you fall, he's there to pick you back up. And when you stumble, come on somebody, he'll be just. He said, I'll forgive all your transgressions, all your iniquities. Huh. Like if, I preach, if I don't preach on both sides, you're not going to grow in all areas. If I don't preach about finances, you're going to be rich spiritually, which is the main thing, but you'll be poor financially. Then we won't be able to get on television. We won't be able to have camp meetings. We won't be able to build new churches. We won't be able to build schools and daycares because you're, everybody's rich spiritually, but nobody's got any money. Come on, somebody. So if I can get you rich spiritually and then preach and tell you that if you give, it'll be given back to you, good measure, heaped up, pressed down, shaken together and running over, then you'll be blessed in your finances. When you get blessed in your finances, now you're rich in spirit, rich in finances. Now you can give and press the gospel. Oh, come on, somebody. Huh? Huh? If I don't preach to you a balance and tell you about growing up in your marriage, you'll have a lot of people that know the Bible that are divorced. Come on, somebody. And so as soon as you get half the church built, half of them leave because they got divorced. Oh, this is good preaching. There's no quicker way to lose half your congregation than all of them get divorced. You just pray that the one that stays is the one that keeps the kids. At least you have the kids. Oh, God have mercy. 
But look here. He says, are you, I'm about done. I don't know if you can take much more, can you? It says, from whom the whole body joined, knit together. We already read this one time. By what every joint supplies. In other words, look here what the Bible says. The Bible said every joint supplies something. Every joint supplies something. It says to every joint what it supplies. That means this joint right here, it supplies something. How many say amen? This joint right here, it's got a purpose. It supplies something. It does something. It has a gift. Huh? It goes uh, in and out this way. This joint goes in and out this way. If you put this joint here, I'm going to walk funny. How many say amen? My, this looks more like a dog's hind leg. This looks like my leg. If I put this there, I'm going to walk like a dog on this side. How many say amen? Huh. These hips, they got joints in there. They have something to give. They have something to give to the body. They have a purpose. That it might not be the greatest purpose, but it is a purpose. Huh. Every part of your body that moves, it's got joints. And the Bible says if you can get all those joints to bring what their gifting is to the body. Oh, is there anybody here? Get them knit together. What's it say it does? Each one does its own part. What happens? Growth. Whew. You know what? The problem is that when people are looking to give, many times they always want to give what they don't have or they want to give what somebody else is giving. God doesn't need you to give what somebody else is giving. If we got, we have got preachers. That doesn't mean that God's going to call you a preacher because if there's already preachers there, maybe he's calling you to do this. Right. Now, now, I hope I'm not getting, I don't want to say that there's no room for any more preachers because there is. But I'm saying don't say that what God wants me to do isn't as good as preaching. And so I'm going to spend all my time trying to be a preacher because maybe right now we need a sound man. Right. <clears throat> Let me say amen. And if you're spending all your time trying to preach, then who's going to run the sound man while Ben's on the computer? Come on, somebody. And I'll, honestly, I'm praying about that. Don't be sending me no deaf sound men. Huh. But I'm, ben, ben, he tries to run the sound, tries to run the TV, tries to get cameras going, tries to run the lights. We need somebody that can sit at the sound that knows how to run the soundboard. If you ain't never run a soundboard before, don't come talk to me. Huh? I need somebody that can run a, somebody, listen, if you used to run sound in a bar, come see me. That's what I'm looking for. I like it loud. I want the first three rows to vibrate when it kicks on. We got that covered. But here's what I'm trying to say. Listen, if you're trying to spend all your time trying to get behind the pulpit, you might be missing what your real calling is. Huh? Which is just as important. You might be trying to spend all your time trying to do this or trying to do that or say, I want to be this or I want to be that. Maybe God called you to be an intercessor. Maybe God's looking for some intercessors that can cover the service with prayer. Is there anybody here? Maybe God's calling some intercessors that can get in and intercede and pray for souls so because he's looking for some prayer covering in the service and you're so busy trying to be an evangelist that you don't even pray. Oh, is there anybody here with me? You're spending so much time trying to be trained to be an apostle. Maybe God just wants you to clean the floor. Me and I don't know, ain't getting no shouts now. The thing of it is, is each joint has something to offer. Huh? Each joint has something to offer. 